Hey guys and welcome to this week's Word on Wednesday. Today we're doing something a little bit different and that is we're going to be baking. Now in the Bible, in 1 Corinthians chapter 12, we see uh, Paul is talking about uh, us being as one body. He says this in verse 12, Just as a body, though one, has many parts, but all its many parts form one body, so it is with Christ. For we were all baptised by one spirit, so as to form one body, whether Jews or Gentiles, slave or free, and we were all given the one spirit to drink. And so the body is not made up of one part, but of many. You see, reading that passage made me think about the church as a cake. Because in a cake, you have loads of different ingredients. You have the sugar, the flour, the cocoa powder, the chocolate chips, the oil with some vanilla essence, and you also have the egg. Now, on their own, they're not completely useless. Uh, obviously, you can use these things on their own. But actually, their use might be very limited. But if you put them all together, it makes a really beautiful cake. Or well, there's probably other recipes that I'm not uh, aware of that you could make with these ingredients. You could feed a lot more people than you could with just, you know, I could probably only feed one or two people with this egg. But if I put all these ingredients together, I might be able to make a cake that serves more than one person. So you see, in a way we are, as the church, we are like a cake. Because yes, individually we have our own gifts and we have our own skills. But it's like Paul says, we are one in Christ, but we are many different parts. And I don't know about you, but I feel really comforted to know that actually I'm part of this amazing body of Christ. That I'm not on my own, that I can be part or I am part of something bigger. Now another element of this is if any of these are missing, you will know about it. If I make a cake without the flour, I think you'd be able to taste the difference. And if I made the cake with only sugar and egg, again, I think you'd be able to taste the difference. And for those of you that come to our Friday Night Youth Group, you might know what a cake tastes like when it's only got egg and sugar in it, and you'll know that it's not very nice. And so that's really the importance of this message, is to recognise that, yes, we are individuals, and God created us to be unique uh, and, to, and to be special, but he also created us to be part of the body of Christ. Now, look what happens when I put all these ingredients together. So, we're going to add in first the oil and the vanilla essence. Going to add in the egg. Not get the shell in there. Cocoa powder, making a bit of a mess here. Making okay, a lot of a mess. And then we're going to add the chocolate chips. Now let's see what happens when I put it in the microwave. <clears throat> and there we have it, a nice mug cake. So there you are, what a great comfort to know that we are individually uniquely made in the image of God, but we are part of the body of Christ. And boy did it taste good. Have a great week guys and we'll see you next time.